Lesson 9. Ways to care for a computer system and storage media. By the end of this lesson, you should demonstrate the need to take care of computers and storage media to prevent data loss. In Lesson 8, we learned about how the user can prevent injuries when using computers. This lesson will discuss ways in which a computer system and storage media should be cared for. Computers are very expensive machines to buy and to repair if they are damaged. Moreover, there is a risk of losing data or information if the computer is damaged or destroyed when you don't have backups. When we are caring for computers, we need to consider both hardware and software parts of a computer system. Let's start by discussing how to care for hardware. Always avoid connecting computers to power during stormy weather because lightning and power surges may damage it. If you want to move the computer, ensure that it is turned off and all cables are disconnected to avoid pulling out cables and damaging the moving parts inside the computer. Keep computers in a dry, cool, clean and safe place to prevent them from contact with heat, dirty liquids and to protect them from being stolen. If you keep your computer or computers where there is dust, ensure that you cover them with protective covers. You should also clean computers regularly using a bit damp cloth or wipe and cleaning solution. Use cleaning solution for the screen case and surfaces of the keyboard. You may also use a blower to blow out dust from the keyboard. Note that you need to regulate the blower so that it doesn't blow out the keys and damage the keyboard. Now that we have discussed how to care for computer hardware, let's talk about things you can do to care for the software. The first thing you need to do is to keep it updated to latest versions all the time. This will make your computer software more secure. You should also ensure that you install and update antivirus software regularly. Don't use shortcuts to shut down your computer system. This may damage the software. Ensure that you shut the system down properly following the right steps. Use the computer file to prevent internet attacks that may result in your information being stolen or damaging of your operating system. Lastly, use system tools that come with the operating system to clean up junk files that the computer creates when processing data. A good example is the Microsoft Drive Optimizer that is now automated in Windows 10 latest versions. If a newly installed program affects the running of your system, and install it immediately. Now that we have discussed how to care for both computer hardware and software, we can discuss how to care for storage media. We have already discussed what storage media is in previous lessons. It includes hard and flash drives, as well as DVDs, CDs, and memory cards. Let's start by discussing how to care for hard drives. The first thing you need to know about hard drives is that they are magnetic media. Therefore, don't put them near magnets or strong magnetic fields. Magnets may erase data or information on hard drives. Both internal and external hard drives have moving parts. Mishandling or shaking the hard drive may damage the read and write heads inside it. Despite not having moving parts, flash drives also need to be cared for. Dust, water, and dirty can damage flash drive connectors. 
Therefore, you should keep them covered when you are not using them. Also, never remove flash drives from the computer while it is reading files. This may damage the drive and the computer. Never force the flash drive into a port or knock the connector against hard things. Hard knocks and force may cause electronic parts of the flash drive to be damaged and connections to be broken. Memory cards should also be cared for in the same manner as flash drives. Note that before connecting flash drives or memory cards to computers, ensure that there are no threats of viruses. As we conclude the lesson, let's look at how to care for optical media. This includes DVDs and CDs. The first thing to do is to always keep DVDs and CDs in cases or plastic sleeves. Ensure that you store them in dry, cool and safe place. In order to avoid scratching the shine surfaces, hold DVDs and CDs around the edges or through the hole that is in the middle. Lastly, clean DVDs and CDs with clean soft cloth or cleaning kit. Revision exercise. Your father has just bought five new desktop computers that he wants to use with his friends in a project. Write down five points that you can use to advise him on how he should care for the computers and storage media that he would use in the project. Summary. In this lesson, you learned about how to care for computer systems and storage media.